Maestro projects are collections of structures and data that you can save in a designated location and then return to later on. To save a project, click the Save button on the Project Toolbar or go to Project, Save As. Type in a name for the project, then click Save. The data in the project is normally saved automatically when you make changes to the project. For example, changes to the entries in the entry list or project table are saved automatically as are changes made in the workspace. Exporting a project is different from saving a project. When you save a project, you are creating a new project to work in. And as you work, changes are saved automatically. However, when you export a project, you are not creating a new project, rather you are making a copy of the current project. Here's an example. We'll save this project as, say, Project X. We can then continue to work in the project as normal. But suppose now we want to send a copy of the project to a colleague, or perhaps just create a copy of the project with only a portion of the data. We can do this by first selecting what we want to export then going to Project, Export Project. And then here, we'll choose to export the project with only those selected entries. Note that the exported project will be compressed by default. It will have a PRJ zip extension rather than the standard PRJ extension for a regular project. When you open a project file, the name of the project will appear at the top, indicating that you are working in a project and that you can carry on from where you left off, knowing that changes you make will be saved automatically. However, when you open a compressed project, those with the PRJ zip extension, you will be working in a scratch project, which means that you will need to save the project first if you wish to make any changes. This is useful in collaboration as it provides an option to view the shared exported projects from colleagues without making unwanted changes to their original project file. If you want to combine a different project with the current project you are working on, you can use the merge operation. Just go to project, then merge, and select the other project. Now all other structures and data from that project will appear in the current project. In addition to saving a copy of a project, you can make backups of projects to guard against data loss. To do so, choose Project, then Backup. Here you can enter a short description of the backup. This description can be used to identify the backup if the project has to be restored. The backup is stored in the PRJ zip format and named with a timestamp as year, month, day, hour, minute and then second. You can schedule automatic backups for projects via the settings in the preferences panel. Just go to Maestro, Preferences, then search for the backup settings and choose Automatic Daily Backups. Here you can also set up email notifications and limit the number of backups. Publishing a project will create a web page .htm or .html file that contains a relative link to a compressed copy of the project. Simply go to project and then publish. You can provide a summary of the project which is included in the web page. And because the link is a relative link, you can copy the page and the project to a suitable location for access on your website. Or copy the link from the page to a suitable page on your website.